Hey, what's up, movie fans? I just got home from seeing Rampage, the latest film starring Dwayne The Rock Johnson. This reunites The Rock along with Brad Payton, who directed the 2015 movie, I believe, San Andreas, another huge action epic. This film stars Dwayne Johnson um, as like a primatologist, I believe the phrase is. I'm probably saying that wrong. Uh, he's a former military man who is now studying um, primates, specifically this giant albino gorilla, which is the only one probably in existence. Well, <laughs> there's some science going on here, and um, let's just say something from a space station type thing falls to Earth, and three canisters of this stuff explode. And it just so happens to be right next to old George the Albino Gorilla, uh, next to an alligator in Florida, and a wolf in, I believe, South Dakota. Well, wouldn't you know it, there's some bad guys here, played by Malin Ackerman, uh, along with her brother, who are doing some nefarious stuff. Um, <laughs> cue in Naomi Harris who plays um, a, a doctor who has worked along this company, uh, who has left for specific reasons that you find out later in the film. It all coincides. The Rock, Naomi Harris, uh, Jeffrey Dean Morgan plays um, some kind of government agent who you find out in the middle of the film, and it all coincides. Dwayne Johnson, he knows how to portray an action-adventure character and he does it to a T. I'm a huge fan of a lot of things including professional wrestling, including Dwayne Johnson, including monsters. Kaijus as you can see I'm wearing a Monster Island shirt. Go team monsters, sorry. But um, and I love I love this movie. It was a lot of fun. I remember playing the video game when I was a wee lad. There is a reference in the film. I'm not going to say it but there is a reference to the video game. I'm sure you can see it. <clears throat> apologize for that um it, it's just a lot of fun yes it is <laughs> there there are some things that are kind of like ugh, but it's an action movie it's a movie that you just want to get a handload of popcorn over and over again and just watch and awe. um you know you you can't help but identify with george this character of this hunted beast that has just a tremendous amount of heart and soul um, you know it, it can't fully um, speak to what it what it thinks and what it feels and sometimes a big lovable ogreish guy like me can completely identify with this character like I said there's some formulaic things in this movie but that's kind of what you want you don't really want it to go off on a tangent where you know some space opera or you know <laughs> a musical number you just want an action movie where the good guy defeats the bad guy and saves the day that's what you want and that's what you get in this movie um just like san andreas this this director brad uh <laughs> he knows how to shoot a cool action movie dwayne johnson he knows how to be the leading man uh malin ackerman i love malin ackerman it's so cool to see her back on the big screen i know she's been uh, tied up with a TV series, and I'm going to check that out because I'm a fan of her work. I think she does a very good job. Her brother is kind of just kind of generic, but she's pretty cool in this. Um, Naomi Harris is really good. Uh, she was Inspector and, um, goodness, the other James Bond movie. I'm have, I'll remember it in a second. But she was also in Pirates. She was one of the, I think she was in Dead Man's Chest, and that was kind of a weaker film, but she was like, one of the best ones in that series and she does a really good job in this movie jeffrey dean morgan he he's very good you know he's got he's doing his best uh tommy lee jones impersonation but he does it pretty well i gotta admit i really hate the character negan and uh, i wanted to hate him in this movie but you can't help but kind of like him a little bit uh you know it's a fun action movie just turn your brain off at the door Watch good versus evil. Can't help but win when you do it like that. If you're going in like, 
Well, actually, uh, the primal origin, when, when you're doing that, like, if you go in like that, you're not going to have a good time. Um, <laughs> I've actually been on the bridge that they were in in Chicago. That was pretty cool. Um, I recognize some of the locale. Very cool. Uh, I want to say thanks for watching my videos. I hope that you check out my other movie reviews. I hope you check this movie out. And please leave a comment and let me know what you think. If you have one you want me to recommend, or you want to recommend a movie for me to check out to avoid, please let me know. Um, currently, YouTube has set an extraordinarily high threshold to make money off videos. So currently, I'm doing these videos uh, for free. But if you'd like to support me, you want to get a cool shirt like this shirt, go to onceuponat.net. And when you purchase it, uh, use my promo code London Hawthorne. That's my username, London Hawthorne. You get a couple bucks off your shirt, and I get a couple bucks off my next shirt. So that's one way to support me if you would like. Thanks so much for watching my videos. Wish you all the best. Please subscribe and share my videos. And uh, let's talk movies.